Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. For anybody who can hear me out there, this is just me testing the mic for seeing whether, well, does this live streaming on YouTube actually work? First time doing it. Only been doing it on Twitch so far, so if anybody can hear me out there, this is the time to let me know in the chat. Thank you very much. Ha ha. Now, let's see if I can make this work properly from my end. Waiting for see how much the delay is. So testing, one, two. Testing, one, two. I can see I got Baird on the line here. Good morning, Baird. Baird, can you hear me out there? Let's see. Fantastic guys, thank you very much. Now, let's try and see if I can get something working here. So, if everything is going okay, good morning. And, uh, well, this is uh, fun. I uh, don't know how many is watching. I can see the chat over here, so it's really nice. How are you doing? Good morning. So, uh, for those of you, usually my students are whatnot watching this here back here, they're like, what? He's playing PGO? What is this? No, but uh, just testing out different things, because, um, Maybe uh, maybe we're gonna do this for, instead of Twitch, I don't know. Just testing it out because one thing I really like about this here is that once I press this end stream button, I don't have to do any upload or any other YouTube magic or editing or whatnot before it's ready on the channel. Then I save some time and, well, it may be weekend. No, oh, is it weekend? No, it's Friday, but it feels like weekend when you have vacation. I can still drink all the coffee I want, right? So guys, Grab yourself a cup of coffee. There's nothing uh, better than that. I can see here that people can hear me perfectly. It's good that the sound is nice. I can even see uh, <laughs> see my brother here. Hi, Simon. How are you doing? I also got a dance. Good on, come on, Simon. But I got it. I know he has vacation as well. And uh, also a special thanks to Baird for also helping me test this out. And uh, any students? Hello, Nihat. So, um, don't know whether I keep this video up on YouTube or not. Anybody can always, uh, uh, you know, go back or such like that. I will read the chat here so I can also call here. You had you make an excellent point. Uh, Twitch is a little more interactive in terms of well, the channel points are super nice, right? Uh, indeed, forcing me to drink coffee. But the real question is, do I really need to be forced to drink coffee, or will I do it all on my own anyway? That's the real question. Thanks for the uh, special thanks to my other brother, Jonas Eriksson, for helping me making this overlay. I really like it. I thought he makes some cool stuff and who doesn't like Viridian Forest, right? Very, very much Gen 1. And I got to have an awesome slowpoke in there. What set is that? That's a fossil slowpoke even, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong, that's fossil, right? That little... Uh, Hand. I was going to say fossil hand, that kind of proves my point, right? No, um, let's uh, look a little at PGO over here. So what do I have in my collection here? Warning to everybody out there, I don't have a lot on PGO. I usually just go on my brother's account and steal all his cards when I need something. So um, one thing I know, you can scan in packs and all these cool things. But when I try to use the scanner right now, it doesn't work because my camera is already on through OBS here. So yeah, um, yeah, that means I have to write in the code manually. Do you really want to write in the code manually? That's the whole thing. Uh, <laughs> that is uh, true. And uh, yeah, if you cut me, I'll bleed caffeine. That That's basically how it is. Now, do I maybe have some packs I can open? Whoa. I got a lot of old packs. Wow. Uh, do I have something newer? Cosmic Chilling Rain. I got two Rebel Clash. I got a... Oh, what's in this? Let's open this and see what it is. What do you get? Ooh, God of War, one of my absolute favorites. I really wish this card, like, wouldn't wish, like, I think it's really good. It's just sad it's stage two, right? So the point is, the ability here, it's insane. Let's just face it, it's insane. So you can look at your top two and attach any number of basic energy cards you find. Sure, it would have been absolutely wild if it was just energy cards, because then you can just double attach all your DCs and whatnot, that would have been Wow. Or, well, nowadays it's twin energy, but DC, you know what I mean. Um, 
Then uh, the brainwave attack, that's not bad at all. Brainwave is just like the one you have on Ore Beetle. Ore Beetle is a quite a fun card. If you look in Expanded, you will see Sander play around with his Ore Beetle Evolution deck. Fantastic concept. Really, really a lot of fun. No, I just like it very much. And, oh, now, Baird, I know you're in the chat here, so uh, indeed, uh, brief talk about the Ice Rider uh, VMAX, right? And they're playing this with the Intelligent Engine. You see it out there a lot. You see it everywhere. This attack is really, really good. Well, also because of the stage one uh, drizzle, drizzle, how you say this, it's fantastic, right? You can simply just go and set up your entire board. People play this with Urshifu, people play with, well, whatever, right? Because finding three basic Rapid Strike Pokemon, very, very consistent. And the Intelli Online is super awesome as well. The stage one is really great. Search out a trainer in your deck. We can take a look at that one later if you want to. And, uh, oh, hi, Nils. Thanks for thanks for dropping by, Nils. Good to see you. And uh, yeah, Bear, I do have a few packs, so maybe we can open a few packs. Like that? Let me know. And um, well, I think it's a really good card because you can also not only the stage one but the stage two. You have two awesome Intellions. One you have the older one, which lets you search out two trainers, so you pretty much grab whatever you want, right? And the new one, which is very interesting. Let's take a look at that one. You can place two damage counters. Now, this is what I think makes the Ice Rider really nice, because the Ice Rider hits... Now, I cannot remember, is it 10 plus 120 for each discard, or is 110? Never, I think it's plus 120 for each discard, so it caps at 250. But if you add this one into the mix, you start hitting 270 with one, 290. But even better, even if you only have one in the play, you can just put 20, hit for 250, then ADP, for instance, have 10 hit points left. The next turn, you can do three prizes in the middle of your turn. There's nothing better than drawing prizes during your turn. It's, yeah, awesome. Hey, if any students are watching, this may be unusual to you guys because I'm not talking about statistics or whatever. I'm just sitting here and babbling about Pokemon because I like to, right? Indeed, it's 10 plus 120, so 250 deed. Yeah, I remember me and Baird speaking about this the other day when we watched uh, Denmark get... <clears throat> I'll say it. There was no penalty. There's no penalty. Hate me for it. What do you want? There was no penalty. But okay. Um, top four. Still good. Better than Netherlands. <laughs> yeah, Intellion is a really good card. And that you have options as well. Now, what do we have? Sonia. Oh, this is a new one. Like, See, opponent discards. The thing is, I like these kind of cards because you have uh, Bill Elbow, Bryson Man, well, which got banned and expanded, I believe, because, well, that was Mill. But draw free, never good. But if you add it with a nice effect, this could be good. But the problem with doing this is you give them the option to discard all their V Maxes, Vs, GXs, whatever they have sitting on there, right? And it's it doesn't it doesn't seem very good unless your objective is to limit their bench. So you can randomly play this against the Turnitus, right? But then you might as well play Path to the Peak, right? Because that just shuts off the ability. That seems evil enough. Fun fact, Pokekid may be a very bad card, but when this card was called Celio's Network back in the day, it was awesome. And it couldn't even search EXs, and it was still played in two, three, four copies in every deck. Just fun to see how the meta have evolved since, well, 15 years ago when I started playing 16, 17? Oh, God. Yeah. Good point, Nils. Indeed, the same as Golbat, but you can do it every turn. But it's a stage two, of course. But it has, like I said, a really good basic in a stage one, which makes it super, super good. Better than you ever done? Bear, what's your best in an internet? Now I'm asking in the chat here. Bear, what is your best internet run? Tell the world. I've seen our worlds. I've seen you in top eight, Bear. Played against... Uh, uh, I'm afraid of mispronouncing names here. But you played against Ross Crawton, right? Yes, you did. Yes, you did. Yeah, it got banned. Milling cards or milling with Bilal Ball was uh, mean. This card I do like. You played with the, uh, well, Shadow Rider, it's called. I want to call it Ghost Rider, but maybe somebody already called that the deck. I don't know. But I have to like the card. Yeah, fifth. Oh, fifth place. It's pretty good, Baird. It's better than my world's run. My best world's placement was 12 back in 07. But we both won regionals before, right? We have both won regionals. Yes, yes, indeed. And, uh, well, Fog Crystal. Search your side deck for a Psychic Energy and a basic Psychic Pokemon. 
seems pretty good to me because what is really important here, it doesn't limit yourself to not pick a non V or GX or whatnot. You can pick any basic psychic Pokemon, which is very, very good, of course. So of course you see this with the Shadow Rider a lot. These decks here. I need to, oh, look, a Volcanion. I mean, a Cresselia. This is just Volcanion. Guys, this is just Volcanion. <laughs> like, come on. It's like, we totally need this here. Well, there's one difference, of course. Volcanion did 50 plus 60, I believe, on its attack. This one is 30 plus 90. So again, you get a damage output more. Oh, and another thing is, was it also five energies Volcanion? And I think it was fire only. There's slight differences on the second attack, but the first attack, that's the same, just with Psychic. Hit points, I don't even remember. It's a little different, everything. Hey, thanks, Aptos. Thanks for dropping by. Yeah, indeed, testing the live stream, see, you know, how does this actually work? And, uh, yeah, worse Volk. It's still pretty good. The Crescent Glow. Like, this works very well with the Shadow Rider, of course, in the sense that you can get so many energies on the board in one attack. If you go second, there's a pretty good chance, especially with the Crystals, easy to pull out, right? Oh, wait. Cannot spread. That is a good call, Bear. I didn't see that. Volcanion, indeed. Now, 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 now I want to know. Blah, blah, blah. Let's look at the Volcanion. Collection. Show not owned. That's a good idea. Pokemon. Now I want to know. Volcanion. Volcanion. Spelling is good, right, guys? There we go. One and then three, and you can put them in any way you like. And Heat Blast was 50 plus 60 with four fire. The other one was five energy in total. So yes, you get the freedom to choose whatever energy you want, but yeah, it's a worse Volcanion. One point, it does have a resistance and one retreat. Going back to this again here. Packs. Ooh, what do I have? Oh, I got bundle packs. Oh, these are not owned. They're not mine. Oh, I got sad for a moment. Ooh, I got a Cosmic Eclipse I can't trade. Let's open it. Oh, I get to do this animation stuff. Awesome. Uh, Nils, for the evolution with the crystal, I think it's only basic. Now we go back and read it again. Now, oh, Will is an awesome card, by the way, guys. Will, awesome. Trilber, fantastic. Great card. What do I get with it? Ah, we got a Drampa. Nothing too awesome. What else do we got? Oh, we got a Plasma Blast pack that I can tra trade lock. For trade lock, I have to open it, right? Then there's no point in me keeping it. Is that correct? <laughs> yeah, and you, co you copy the homework and you make it slightly worse, right? Is that the whole point? Like, I'm not going to say I've seen students do that. But yes, I've seen students do that. And indeed, uh, it is can I copy your homework and then do it a little worse? Um, when I have stuff trade, a question for everybody out there. When I have stuff trade locked in here, I can't. I, I just have to open it, right? Cool. Then I just have to open it. And uh, Nils also for translating everybody who doesn't read Danish. In the league, they said they could take evolutions as well, but the league they were wrong. Then read the card. You can only take basics then. Open trade locked. Thanks, Xenon. Let's do that. Let's see what we get. Plasma Blast Boosters. Oh, this is a long time ago already. It feels like ages ago. Now, I'm very happy that this test goes well so far. People are okay with all this. Yeah. Oh, so let's see what we get. Lapras. Ooh. Silver Bangle. Put that on a Donphan and you're good to go. What do we get? Salamence. Meh. This one is not trade lock. This one is trade lock. Sword and shield. Let's open that. I don't have a lot of packs in here. I really need to scan more. But if I I can't scan now because I have my camera on here, so I don't know how that's gonna work. Ooh, this looks a lot new already. Yeah, all in there. Guys, this card is great. Stun Fisk is awesome. Like, don't sleep on this beast. Well, maybe because I play too much in Professor Cup, it's too much fun. But um, let's see what we got. We got. Uh, Cloister? No, no, no. Like I learned in Dutch, twee woorden, negen letters, gewoon nee. Just no. That card is no, 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 no. 
I got 14 battle star pack. Oh, two trade lock rebel clash. Let's look at this. Ooh. Never thought I was gonna sit and open packs live. Not gonna lie. Do I have any updates on my? Uh, nope. Oh, phone needs to charge. Go. There we go. Oh, newest addition to full art collection, uh, boys and girls. A Caitlin Rainbow. Amazing card. Like it looks really, really pretty. Card's not good. Maybe it becomes better later. Who knows? I'm not gonna sit here and uh, doom the card already. But um, at first look, meh. But it does look nice. Rainbow. We like the rainbows, don't we? Oh, that's cool. Oh, I got a whole stack of codes here. Maybe I should scan it. That's just some of the codes. I got a whole box full. Of just codes. Like, uh, that would be fun. Like, uh, anybody wants a free code? I can just write some in the chat. Yeah, I'm gonna. Anybody wants a free code? Let's see. Uh,. I feel generous today because now I'm, I'm just going to share all this here because uh, sharing is caring, I've heard. Yeah, I know. This is just for testing. I know I hate just opening packs and be like a what a pack opener. No, uh, no uh, offense to those who do it. It's just not my thing usually, but this is just for testing. Here's a code for anybody who's first come, first serve. That sounds good, right? Yeah, opening packs on stream. Let's put this button in here. It's a fantastic sheep. Wait, I need to have to do it this way here because it's a fantastic sheep, but my screen is on the other side. Ugh, I need to mirror my uh, mirror my camera a little bit better because now I'm sitting and looking at my screen, guys, but you're seeing me looking away. I need to mirror this thing, but maybe another time. <sighs> True streamer, yeah. Maybe that's what I need to grow my channel to like 10,000 subs, but it's amazing. I did manage it, and thanks to everybody who supported me in, in this endeavor here. That's been fantastic. Now, what do we have? Oh, we still got one more trade locked there, Rebel Clash Pack. Let's uh, look at that. I like this. I'm out of coffee. Let's put some more in. We need coffee. <laughs> oh, love coffee. Oh, we got two things in this pack. What is going on with this? Let's see, what do we have? What is this? Prevent all damage. Oh, cool. That's an old ability. We had that back in the day. What else do we got? Um, hey, let me know if you use the street the, the key. If the key is used, be a be a good guy to everyone and say, hey, uh, it's used already, or if it works. Digger speed. <laughs> Couldn't I just you know open an awesome pack on stream? That would be cool. You hear all this like you see them. Oh my god, I opened an awesome pack. Blah blah blah. Let's see. I got some vivid voltage. What is good in the voltage, guys? Chunk at you? Big chunky rainbow chew? Let's see. Maybe I can also make one of them thumbnails where I go like, oh! <gasps> now, let's see what I get. Beat drill. If you do, we put a free card. Okay, no, not bad. What do we get here? Oh my god, it's a cake. Mmm. Or it's cream. Yum. You may have each player draw a card. Wow. Fun with Persian if they're dumb enough to draw a card. Let's try another one. At least it opens the trade lock ones first. That's good because I can see now I have multiple ones, right? So that's good. What do we get? Oh, two things. Let's see. What do we get? What do we get? Ooh, the horrid. That's pretty. Not as pretty as the new evolu uh, Evolving Skies Eevee that's coming out. It was in the Evolution Hero. Eevee Hero set, right? Nah. Oh, an Arm Frost V. I think Bear's right. Awful set. But that's Chunk at you. What do we got? Ooh. I got two Chilling Rain packs. What do we need to open? Let's just open it. Yeah, yeah. Let's just see what I got. Chilling rain. Let's go. Ooh. So this testing stream turned out to me just opening packs for now. Uh, feel free to ask anything if you have anything. Uh, and uh, I hope you guys are enjoying it so far. Like, uh, what do we got? We got free people viewing. It's awesome, guys. I'll take it. Let's see. Does it actually work? Ah, it works beautifully, this stuff. Works beautifully. Now I can even hear myself back. I'm also trying to figure out how much the delay actually is. I think it's around 10, 15 seconds, actually. I need to get used to that as well. Um, now, what do we have here? Let's see what this card is. That was a terrible card, isn't it? Yeah, that's terrible. 
But look, everything is just new. I haven't opened anything. Open another one. Yeah. Oh my god, what did we get? We got a Galarian Weezing. Yeah, Ice Rack. I still prefer it, uh, Baird, when you made the one for Owl and Leaves. That was a better one. It never beats a rainbow farting uh, whale. Still the best one. Melian is a good card, sure. This card is also like, I don't know what to think about it. Seems, you can, oh, you can choose both. Okay, I'll take it back. That card seems pretty good. Seems pretty good recovery. Put up to two Pokemon for me. Discard pile. Indeed, also for calling out Nils for earlier. This includes evolution Pokemon as well. And you get off the basic energies. Sure, this would have been absolutely wild if, again, you could take special energies. So, yeah. Let me see. What are we looking at here? Search deck for free Rapid Strike Pokemon. Put onto your bench. So, that's basically their call for family and a supporter thing. Okay, cool. What have we got? What have we got? I need to make a video on Doctrio. Why do I need to make a video on Doctrio later? Simple. Because it has a flip attack that can make it sort of immune. And you can, well, do the math. That's cool. Math. Oh, yeah. Whoa, I got some really old packs. What have we got here? Avatar stuff. Gameplay. Guys, I locked in. I got the Beedoof stuff. Beedoof stuff is awesome. Like, I'm one of those who think this was a great idea. Oh, I played Player's Cup too. Proof. Woo. Uh, Professor Cup. Twice. Unfortunately, I don't think I would participate in the summer one we have here again. Uh, because, simply because the time zone is terrible. Kind of want my sleep and want to spend time with my daughter, obviously. She's sleeping right now, which is, well, why I'm here. Ooh, I also put it in a team challenge. I did terribly. Who cares? I got stuff. Ooh. What else do we have? No, really, we got a lot of stuff. I even forgot what is in all those old sets. Let's just open some vivid packs. Then I can always. Uh... Oh yeah, print box of tomorrow, bear. Good luck with that. So um... I printed some very beautiful proxies here as well, and uh, we're gonna be playing Epic Splash. So for anybody who have not see is seen Epic Splash, you play four matchy carps and you play a matchy carp break which is 40 hit points. There's nothing else to it. And then you play, of course, Exodia pieces because you need to be able to win on Exodia. So I scale these up so they fit a normal card size. And uh, Epic Splash, fun format. You're gonna try, if you haven't tried it out, go try it out. That is hilarious. Now, let's see what I got in these packs. Come on, chunk at you. It's Donphan, I'm happy. It's a Donphan. We're good, it's Donphan. It is fantastic. I love Donphan. Dolphin is a great Pokemon. No arguments there. And I got... Oh, yeah. Another one? Let's open the last one I got. Thank you very much, Bert. Good that this worked. Then I also know that when... Um, so, for those who haven't uh, noticed yet, on Sunday I'll be streaming together with uh, Sander Wojcik where we're going to be talking post-rotation control. So, what will be good? What do we think will be good? What not? You know, anything. And uh, you guys can also drop by live, ask any questions you may have, and then I'll take a look at the chat. So, and then we'll see what we can uh, figure out. Basically, my objective in that, uh, in that discussion is going to be like making sure Sandra doesn't talk about one card for 40 minutes straight. We need to get uh, more cards over with, right? Now, what do I remember here? No, I think this was all. I hope you guys enjoyed this little stream, this test stream. Um... This should be okay, right? Yeah, that'll be fine. Now, uh, hope you enjoyed it. Then um, I will uh, close down, uh, close shop again. And uh, hey, I'll maybe maybe just leave the video here on YouTube. Then I can look back and see how my uh, test went. I think it went okay. And I can also hear from you guys. It went okay. And uh, thanks, Baird, for also checking by. And uh, thanks for everybody else who, to, who dropped by. This was fair, fun. Maybe we should do it some other time. If you have any suggestions to what I could live stream with, well, let me know. I'm not a pack opener, but if I PGO anyway, why not open a few packs online at least? Seems like fun. And um, yeah, for students out there, maybe live starter. 
maybe just live solving stuff or you know live lecturing on twitch is still nice not sitting here disrespecting youtube directly but uh it is indeed more interactive and these uh channel points are nice too you don't need to force me to drink coffee i drink it anyway but you can force me to say heteroscedasticity a lot that's what happens over there stefan's classroom on twitch anyone if you haven't checked it yet hmm Fantastic stuff, this coffee here. It is literally, I would call it liquid gold, but it's brown, so what do we call it? Brown water. Yeah. Okay. If that was it, guys, I wish you all a fantastic day. It's Friday, right? Yeah, it is Friday. And uh, I'm just going to enjoy my vacation. But in any case, play some Epic Splash tomorrow. Sunday, we're going to stream some stuff. Ooh, I almost forgot. There's one thing I want to test still, guys. So, please, if anybody sees this here, if it should work now, I should have a little screen on my screen now. Uh, you can see here, uh, this is a stream, so a shout out to Limitless. This is taken from the Limitless translation site. I'll see if I can remember to put a link in the description below. And see on, uh, you can take the questions live. You can just come on live and ask the questions. So you can save them for Sunday, put them in the chat, and I'll uh, I'll pick out questions from there. So if you have any questions for Sunday for then, perfect. Now we're going to be using this here, so we're going to be going over some cards here, like uh, Crystal Cave is cool. Sunday wants to talk about Crystal Cave, and I know exactly why, because uh, I see rough seas. Don't know about you guys here. What else do we got? Copycat's coming back. Awesome. Schoolgirl. Draw two cards. Bonus has six for two prize. You two more. Mm. Rayhan. That is good now there's some really cool cards here upcoming in the set so and again shout out to limitless for the site here i will be uh, we'll be looking through uh, scans on their site here i'll leave in the link in the description below and for the rest we're going to just look at other pto is going to see here so we're going to have a screen that looks very much like the one you see here just adjust it a little for size and everything so i hope you got that one seen on in terms of questions for sunder you can leave them for sunday then you can uh, drop by Full face shield attached to an ability it takes 20 minutes. Cool. So if you know ability, you can. Oh, uh, uh, reduction by 20. Yeah, we've seen better. But there's some cool cards. So that's what we're going to be doing. And, uh, ooh, I, uh, I see a familiar name there. Hi, Mid. Hello, Mid. Good to see you, and uh, well, you just made it before I'm about to go now. Just testing my stream today. If you haven't, uh, if you're just dropping by now, this is just a test stream, seeing if everything is working. First time going live on YouTube, never done that before. But um, I'll go live again on Sunday at three in the afternoon. So that's a uh, CEST, Central European Summer Time. I think that's what it stands for. And um, then we we'll check it from there. That'll be cool. And uh, yeah, you're welcome, everyone. Have a good day. And uh, that was all I have for you guys. Hope you enjoyed it. And uh, well, this was Stefan Eriksson, Stefan's Classroom. First live stream ever. Bye guys. On YouTube that was.